The 1930s setting of Ip Man takes place in Foshan, the center of southern Chinese martial arts, where numerous schools actively seek new students and engage in competition with one another. The most accomplished martial artist in Foshan is the Wing Chun master Ip Man, who maintains a low profile and is humble. He feels no need to take on any disciples because he is a self-made millionaire and instead spends his days training, seeing friends, and spending time with his family. But his wife frequently feels resentment toward the time he devotes to martial arts training and conversation with friends and co-workers. Ip Man is regarded in Foshan despite not being a professional martial artist because of the skills he exhibits in friendly behind closed door competitions with regional experts. When Ip Man overcomes Jin Chan Zhao, an arrogant, harsh, and accomplished northern Chinese martial arts master, he further enhances his reputation and upholds the local pride of other southern stylists and others in Foshan. Everyone in Foshan suffers as a result of the Japanese invasion in 1937. The Japanese occupy Ip's man home and use it as their Foshan headquarters. Ip Man and his family are made to live into a rundown home after losing their riches. Ip Man accepts a job as a coolie at a coal mine out of a desperate need to provide for his family. Chinese martial artists compete with his military recruits in an arena set up by Japanese General Miura, a master of karate. For each game they win, the Chinese receive a bag of rice. The offer is being made to the martial artists working as coolies by Li Zhao, a former police officer and Ip's acquaintance who is currently employed as a translator for the Japanese. Ip Man first says no to taking part in the bouts. However, he consents to participate in the investigation after his friend Lin goes missing. After losing a second fight against three karateka, he is furious to watch a fellow fashion master, Master Liu, brutally murdered for picking up a bag of rice from a previous victory. He also learns that Lin was slain in an earlier altercation. Ip Man requests a simultaneous match with ten karateka, hardly able to control his wrath. He proceeds to mercilessly crush each of them with a brutal yet effective barrage of his martial art mastery, despite not having practiced Wing Chun since the invasion started, in order to conserve what little food his family had to survive. Displaying hardly any of the restraint he displayed in previous engagements. Miura is intrigued by Ip Man because of his talent and wants to know more about him and see him engage in combat once more. Ip Man travels to Foshan to see his buddy Chao Ching Chuan, who owns and operates a cotton mill. Chao informs Ip that a highway robbery group headed by Jin Chanzhao is intimidating and blackmailing his employees. Ip Man instructs its employees in Wing Chun self-defense. When Ip Man does not enter the ring, Miura becomes impatient and sends men to find Ip Man. Ip Man renders these men helpless as they are harassing Ip's man family. Then, Ip Man and his family hide at Li Zhao's home. The robbers return to the cotton mill in the meantime and demand money. Using the strategies Ip Man taught them, the employees respond by fighting back. Jin Shanzhao is then defeated by Ip Man, who issues a warning to him not to bother the workers ever again. Ip Man is eventually located at the cotton mill by the Japanese forces. Ip Man is told by Miura that if he accepts to teach the Japanese soldiers martial arts, his life will be saved. Miura accepts the challenge because he loves martial arts, and because turning down the challenge would be embarrassing for the Japanese. In Foshan Square, the game between Ip Man and Miura is open to the public. The two combatants appear to be evenly matched at first, but Miura quickly loses control and is helpless against Ip's man strikes, as he uses him as a wooden dummy to easily beat him and win. Ip Man hears the Chinese cheering the defeated general as he lies down, and he looks over to the throng where he sees his wife and child with Chao. Sato, Miura's deputy, then kills Ip Man. The Chinese crowd and the Japanese soldiers fight as a result. Li Zhao shoots Sato to death using Sato's own gun during the altercation. In the midst of the mayhem, Ip Man is removed. It is shown that he lives and makes it with his family to Hong Kong. Ip Man opens a Wing Chun school there, where Bruce Lee eventually enrolls.